What I'm going to do is we're just going to run through where's your business at, what's going on, what are the problems are you facing right now, where are you stuck. I'm just going to try and like do a very gentle um, pull apart from your business and current situation and then we'll start piecing together some next steps and I want to make sure that you can walk away with some homework, knowing what to do, all that kind of jazz. We cool with that? Yeah, thanks, thanks. Awesome, all right. Now, let's be perfectly honest. You're probably confused about what it is that you need to do to build your dream online business. There's more podcasts, there's more videos, there's more books, there's more articles. Then you can poke a stick out for when it comes to what it is that you need to be doing, and there's just simply too much information. That's why in this episode, I'm sharing with you what it is that you could be doing exactly and how you can get a free consultation with me, pulling apart your business and giving you the exact solutions that you need to be able to do to get more cash, more clients, and more freedom. Hi, I'm Chris Dufay, and I show you how to build a body, business, and life that you love. In this episode, you're gonna be seeing behind the scenes of a private one-on-one -on -one consultation with Zoe. Zoe is a online and face-to-face -face vegan coach, and we go through exactly what she needs to be able to do to get more leads, to be able to get more clients, and to be able to earn more money with less time as well. We literally break down all these spots, and this is where I wanna be able to give these free consultations in this series. I wanna give you these, what you want, whether it's you wanna be able to have a better body, whether you wanna be able to have a better business, whether you wanna be able to build build a better life, have more freedom. These are the things that I'm really passionate about. So what I want you to do is I want you to go to, click the link below and go to chrisdufay.com forward slash ask. That is where you're gonna be able to ask your questions to then I can choose who to bring on into these episodes and that could be you as well. So what I want you to do, I want you to enjoy this episode. Take note because there's plenty that we go through and there's a lot of great key takeaways. I'm so happy Zoe was so open and willing to share all of this because it really does give you an insight into how a coaching business is currently set up when someone is doing a really good job, but as the way that I say it, it's a bit of a Swiss cheese problem. There's a few holes and we need to be able to plug those holes for her to be able to earn so much more money because her goal is to get to 50,000 a month. How does that happen? Well, you'll see inside this episode as well. So be sure and click the link below to if you wanna be able to get a free consultation to join us into this series. And I'm really looking forward to hearing from what you have to say after this. Who are you? This is the first time we're chatting. Um, what's going on? So I'm Zoe. I'm a vegan health coach. Yep. Um, I've been vegan now for five years. Yeah. Um, since yeah, five years ago, um, I I noticed a lot of changes in my in my the way I felt. I had heaps more energy when I went vegan. So then I just carried on and then just sort of wanted to educate and inspire a lot more people. So then I became a bodybuilder and I compete as a vegan bodybuilder just to show people that you can actually build muscle on a vegan diet. Awesome. And that's when it sort of um, got me more excited. I really wanted to share it with a lot more people. So I became a personal trainer and now I do it sort of physically one-to-one -one, and I do it online through my programs too. You're currently doing face-to-face -face coaching and online coaching right now, is that correct? Yeah, that's right. Yep. Okay, awesome. Let's just talk face to face. And like, let's say if I rocked up to the gym and I was like, hey, Zoe, I want to come on board um, your training. I want to become a client of yours. Um, what is the current process? Like, what am I actually signing up to? Is it like a block of sessions? Is it I just choose how many, how many times I want to train a week and you charge me for the month? Like, how does that work? Uh, it's how many times you want to train a week and then it's just direct debited every week so it's not like a 10 block or whatever I just do yep. it every week until they want to stop <laughs> hopefully never and just continue <laughs> yep <laughs> okay good so if I signed up to your online coaching right now what am I getting how much am I paying and how does that currently work Got a few different programs some some like really low ticket items like $49 yep. up until my highest range one is a $5,000 program so they're in between I've got a magic wand. I give the magic wand to you, Zoe. You wave it. You can have anything that you want. In 12 months from now, what does your business look like? Oh, it's massive. Absolutely massive. I would love my own gym with a juice bar, a smoothie bar, a vegan gym. It's on the beach. And I'm educating people and doing little workshops as well as working out in the gym too. 
Yep. First is massive, and I'm earning about 50000 a month. Okay, so this gives me a really quick breakdown of what's going on. So we kind of know, like, through the pipeline, um, yeah. where are people, like, where's the leaks in the pipeline at the end of the day? Do you know what I mean? So obviously we can increase everything, but if you increase the thing that might have the biggest leverage point, then you can easily double the amount of leads or double the amount of clients, and we only need to make one small tweak. So I'm trying to find out what do we need to do to get the biggest impact as fast as possible right now. So that's cool. So if we look at your business right now, there's three main parts. There's attract, how do you actually attract leads, convert, yeah. how do you turn leads to clients, and then deliver, how do you actually deliver the programs that you are. So let's say I just randomly bumped into you on the street and I go, Zoe, what do you do? Now, I want you to answer it in three parts. I want you to answer who you help. I want you to answer yeah. with what is the one result that you get your clients? And I want you to answer the third part with what makes you unique or different. So who do you help? Um, what's the one result and what makes you unique? What would they be? I help people to live a happy, healthier life. Yep. Doing that through educating them physically, mentally and spiritually. Um, through exercise, nutrition and mindset. Yep. And I do that. By educating them on them living a vegan life. Yep. Like maybe the unique thing. So, what would be the differentiator between you and other vegan coaches? Mm, I want a vegan bodybuilding competition. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. No, that's good. Though, normally, uh, not normally. Uh, in most cases, people don't care about you. They care about what you can do for them. So oh, yeah. how can you translate that into what people uh, really want? Because people, people are going to think about themselves. This is good. And this kind of, like the thing that pops into my head is you kind of have to sell people on what they want and then give them on what they need. And most cases, the want yeah. is weight loss. We're talking to the ego at the end of the day. So I want to get yeah. into the shape. I want to look sexier. I want to be more attractive to my wife, husband, partner. I yeah. really want that stuff, but we know at the end of the day, I need to be able to function better as a human being. Do you know what I mean? I need yeah. to be healthier and all those different markers that we can categorize as health. Like they're the things that truly create a transformation and to actually get in great shape and stay in great shape, we know that health is so important. So we need to be able to give them that. Um, yeah. But we need to talk to the ego side in that marketing piece as well. So I think okay. if you specifically help um, you're going to have to get specific on like the people that you are wanting to help, but you get, you want to help people lose weight through a vegan lifestyle. And then we kind of clarify what that is. I think that would be really important to okay. create that descriptive, but that's the one we need to be really specific with what your message is, who your market is, what exactly it is that you want to be able to give them. Um, and how can your content and your messaging be congruent with that so we just need better content that talks to the market specifically so you get known as the authority uh, number yeah. two we need to put out what we'll just call frictionless offers so when it okay. gets people to um, get a recipe when it gets to join a Facebook group when it gets to booking a call we need to make yeah. sure that we're making it really easy for them to take those next steps so let's just say today what I want you to do is yeah. um, do a recipe post and okay. tell them to, if they want the recipe post, comment below with yes, and then what it is, you'll direct message them and give them the link to then opt in. And we wanna see how many opt-ins that we can get from that. Um, All right. Number cool. three, we're gonna send a really easy message out to the people that know you. So think of that kind of relationship building bottom of the funnel section. We wanna get them into the calls. I'm just gonna send you a template where what I want you to do is a, uh, a message into your Facebook uh, group. And I want you to use like one of the best photos that you've got the best engagement with so far. So a photo of you and your face, but like a post that you've done before that you know has got really good engagement. I want you to use a photo like that or use okay. the exact same photo again, um, just so yeah. we can get the best engagement. We want them to be able to then consume 
what you have in your status. And then number four, we're gonna run a Facebook ad that's gonna collect people into booking a call. So we've got two things that are about booking a call. We've got one thing that's specifically about getting more opt-ins and more leads. And then we've got another thing that's gonna be specific about your messaging and content, which effectively covers all three categories but we want more people to know who you are. So we want to grow the umbrella of who the hell knows Zoe and likes this stuff at the end of the day. Okay, cool. That sounds good. How's that sound? Awesome. Okay. Thank you so much for your help. That's awesome. My really, really absolute helpful. pleasure. That's really good. Great. Thank awesome. you for that. Now, this is where I want to make sure that you get the most out of being here and I want to hear from you. So if you've enjoyed this episode, click like and to make sure I can send you the new episodes each and every week, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Also, I really want to make sure that I'm giving you exactly what you need. So comment below. I want to know what you're going to take away from this episode. And the best conversations after every episode always happen in the Breaking Success. Tribe. I'll pop a link below for you to join the free group so you get access to the guides, the live streams. I'm in there answering your questions personally each and every day, plus you get all the episodes as well. So thank you so much for being here and joining us. I'm really looking forward to seeing you in the next episode.